Greetings all, Fanny here for Libra's Daily Oracle Message. Libra, I hope you guys are having a good Sunday. Your first card that came up is Step Back. You're being asked to step back from your life in order to gain perspective. You're too close to a situation, and it can be hard to make a decision. Span out and view your life from a distance so that you can get per the perspective needed. Sometimes we are just too close to a situation because... We're so focused on getting the outcome of it or making everything perfect that we could be overworking it. And similar to when we're looking, when we're working on an, on an art piece, for example, and you're just so focused on one corner of the picture, you could be overworking it. And when you finally do step back, it doesn't fit in with everything else that you've already done. As opposed to if you took your time, worked a little bit on it, took a break, stepped back, examined the, how the picture has developed and how everything reacts to it. Because you might choose to take it in a different direction and give the whole thing and your life a fresh start. The card states you're being given the opportunity to begin again. Allow yourself to embrace this new life and open up fully to the gifts that are being given. I love that that's coming in in pair with the step back card because there there's the footprints and then there's the hands. So this is like a full body, full movement shift and change that your life is taking. And and I understand that that, that can be very scary, especially if, because with your the step back card, I certainly feel like you were so focused on what's going on in your life and maintaining what you already have that. I don't feel like you were enjoying it, first of all, and I feel like you might be overlooking some of the miracles that are going on around you. You're being asked to pay extra close attention to the miracle, to all the big and small miracles that have already occurred in your life, and also those that are currently occurring and are still to come. Miracles surround you. Be on the lookout for them. Yeah, and if you're so nose to the grindstone, focus on just getting something done by a physical, concrete date. Or whatever it is you can be completely overlooking everything going on around you because you're just so focused that's why I think it's so important that you have the um, the fresh start with the the hands holding the seedling here because that can be something so small and so delicate but cared for correctly it can blossom and thrive like your life there will be miracles that add to the development of it all I feel like there's a part in the middle of the deck here that wants to come out. Okay, it's that one. Uh, I don't know, the, the deck is still kind of looking weird, but I'll get back to that in a second. Yeah, patience. You're being asked to practice patience right now. It's not easy to do this, but you're strong and there's a reason that things aren't aligning in the way you want them to in this moment. Have patience, it will work out eventually. And I think that that's probably why you need to have that step back and have that first start because there's something that may be coming in that's reorienting and redirecting you from what you are focusing on right now. But if the ego is so stuck on how they believe the blessing should come, they're not accepting it from any other way, they won't, they won't like this. And I love that the bravery card came out for you here because... It would take a lot of bravery. It would take a lot of faith and trust in yourself, in the spirit team that is protecting you, that is asking you to have the patience. It would take a lot of bravery for you to take that step back, for you to just allow and surrender to the universe. You're being asked to make a tough decision that you've been putting off because of fear, which is understandable, but you do have the strength and bravery to make this decision and you will feel so much lighter when you do, because everything that you've been going on in your head, in your heart, in your everyday world, it creates a physical weight against you and on your shoulders. And you might not even realize how much is being put on you until you're collapsing, until you're breaking. And I don't want you to get to that point, my love, because you are so beautiful. You are so wonderful. I just feel like you have a shield in one hand and a wand in the other. You have the ability not only just to create your miracles, but protect and prolong them. Because you can have balance in all things by having patience in yourself. But 
it will take work. It will take shifting a perspective, especially if this is something very new that you've been you've been thinking about. I want you to go ahead and go for it. Allow it to happen. Allow the world to happen for you, not to you. Similar to anything bad that happens, this is happening for you, not to you. And you might not understand in that moment, but you will one day because if you take the time to do the meditation and to observe your life, you'll understand that everything happens for a reason. There are no coincidences and there are no accidents. Have a beautiful day, Libra.